Hey everyone, I'm Mark Sievers, and today I'm gonna show you my favorite grilled cheese on the planet that I make at home all the time. Don't judge. <laughs> it's a dill pickle grilled cheese. I have been making this since I was probably 10 years old. I've always loved grilled cheese sandwiches and dill pickles. And then my nan one day put them together for me, and it was like, like this big moment of like absolute bliss and I've been making it ever since. So I'm gonna show you how to make it, but first I'm gonna get one onto my panini maker so that I can show you at the end of this video. So that's, we're gonna, hear that sizzle? That's gonna be delicious. So dill pickle grilled cheese. It really is three ingredients and it's really simple and I love this because it uses the most beautiful classic white sandwich bread. I tested it with artisan bread and ciabatta and all these gorgeous other things and I thought, no, no. This just needs good old classic white sandwich bread. So let me give you a little overhead of action here. So I have two pieces of beautiful bread and I'm gonna spread each one of them with about a teaspoon of room temperature unsalted butter. Don't neglect the corners. I learned that a long time ago. You know when you get a grilled cheese in a restaurant and the kind of the edges are not so delicious? Well, this is going to remedy that for you. So a little bit of butter, really, really delicious. Some people use mayo, you can do that too. I just happen to like butter for this. So, and then I'm going to turn them over. And here I have two ounces of shredded Colby Jack cheese. So this is gonna be delicious. I'm gonna put about an ounce onto one side. And then I have a half a cup of really vinegary dill pickle chips. The dill pickle really does add such fabulous flavor. The vinegary-ness bite cuts through the kind of heaviness of the cheese and really cuts through the fat and I just think it's so perfect. If you can't find, uh, if your favorite, I should say, if your favorite brand of dill pickles come in a spear form or a uh, not chip, you can just dice them really quick and nobody is gonna care. So put a little bit of freshly cracked black pepper, a little bit of salt, these measurements are on my website, so sit back, relax, and let's get cheesy. <laughs> that was actually really cheesy. Uh, <laughs> and then I'm gonna put the other ounce of uh, shredded cheese on top. So this kind of like encases the pickles so that it gets really melty and gooey. And then I'm gonna put the other piece of bread on top, press it down a little bit, and then See, let's look to see how our sandwich is doing. We're gonna turn this heat up a little bit. And this is really going to be, I think your new kind of fun, delicious grilled cheese. This takes about five minutes in a panini maker, or you can also do it, we're gonna press this down. You can also do it on, uh, in a medium uh, skillet, sort of a medium heat on the stove, like a classic grilled cheese, turn and turn and turn. The other thing I love to do with this grilled cheese, I'm gonna let this sizzle a little bit more so you can, so we can get a big old delicious bite. The other thing I love doing with this grilled cheese is cutting it up into small triangles and serving it as a cocktail party, as an hors d'oeuvre. I think people go crazy. They think, dill pickle grilled cheese, I don't want that. Then they take a bite and you step back and you go, mm -hmm, I told you so, I wouldn't lie to you. So this is really a delicious version of this grilled cheese. And you can make this into croutons. You can do all kinds of things with this. So this is perfectly done now, the, the one that I have pre-done in here. So we're gonna take it off of this delicious, ooh, that's hot and toasty. Let's take a little bite here. Oh, perfect. All right, let's see, dill pickle grilled cheese hot right off of the press. Really hot, really delicious. You guys are gonna go crazy at home. Please like this video, subscribe to my channel, 
Head over to marcusevers.com for this full written recipe along with many others, kitchen ideas, and of course lots of entertaining tips and tricks. I've got a grilled cheese to eat. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I'm eating more. I don't care. That's the perks of recipe testing and filming. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>